So the brand new Yu-Gi-Oh! Speed Duel Midterm Destruction set just came out and it actually might be one of the best TCG sets of the year. And I know that might sound crazy, but let me tell you, when you guys know what's inside of here, you guys might realize how much value is packed into this little $15 booster box. So with that being said, I want to show you guys what you can find in here and talk a little bit about why this might be one of the best sets to come out so far this year. And to be honest, it's GX based, so you know we have to open it on the channel. So we don't have just one or two, but three of these speed duel boxes to open up for you guys today. And I'm really excited because I want to talk about, first of all, why this set is so good for the TCG, not just for speed duel, but also why this is just a really cool set in general. So again, we got three of these and they contain structure decks in them, which we're going to go through the structure decks once. I don't want to go through them over and over again because these are pre-constructed structure decks. So after we go through the first one, it's going to be the same the entire rest of the time. But this box, first of all, I love this. I love this. Neos on here. You got some dino stuff in here. You got fossil dino in here. And uh, oh, fossil dino is actually not on here. This is a fossil warrior, but fossil dino is in here. Kind of spoiler. Okay. I'm really excited. So let's get right into this. Now, for anyone who doesn't know how these things work, essentially, you get a booster box like this one. And then the booster box is going to come with a mystery pack. So a pack that is going to have a bunch of random promos. And then the rest of the box is the sealed structure decks. So let's open one up. Okay. First things first, we see elemental hero Neos over here. I'm going to be excited to be opening this up because first of all neo secret rare is really cool and uh these decks are over here as well so the decks kind of are uh, if you're trying to get into speed duel these are kind of what you're playing for right and i think that's it there's a little bit of a black box in here i don't know if you can take that out yeah i think that's it though all right so let's go through this first one and then i'll open up the other two just to go through the uh promos but i want to show you guys why this set i think is so good and why there's so many good reprints in here especially if you're a newer player so First things first, this set is only $15 Canadian, so $14.95. So if you live in America, it might be closer to like $10 to open this up. And I also heard that this is not coming out in Europe. So if you're European, apologies, I don't know if this is coming out or not. But for Americans and for Canadians, and I think South Americans as well, you guys get all these cards. Now, why is it really good? First things first, Neos Alias. You guys might be wondering, why is Neos Alias any good? Well, if you've ever played Edison format, you know that Hero Beat, Diva Hero, even Zombie Hero are legitimate decks. And Neos Alias is one of the best cards for that format. So you get cards like Neos Alias, Card Trooper. So really good for Edison. Dandelion here as well is also really good for Edison. And if you're ever just starting out in the TCG, you're getting access to all of these cards that you guys can be using in your hero decks, right? Because you have the Neo stuff in here, of course, but you guys are going to see that there is some uh, elemental hero stuff here as well. And then um, on top of that, in the TCG, at least, I think in uh, North America and South America, you can still use these cards in the TCG. So it's not just used for speed duel. The rule is essentially speed duel cards can be used in the TCG. TCG cards cannot be used in speed duel, right? So Hero Blast here, by the way, also is a very, very good card for Edison. And uh, there's just some really good reprints in here aqua neos glow neos aqua neos is actually important in one of those uh neo spills where you kind of try to hand rip and that's really cool in here so really cool reprints as well so that's it for that and then you also have a lot of dino reprints in here as well so archosaur is a common baby sarasaurus and again if you're just getting started out in the tcg i don't want to say this is the best product to buy i would say if you have access to rarity collection something like that is probably way better because you're gonna get a lot of the staples but the really cool thing about this speed duel set is it does have cards like fossil dig has a lot of the most important like cards for a lot of these decks typhoon's a really cool card here as well you have what else you guys actually got in here i'm, I'm not even sure what is all in here you got level white level 10 white cyber dark prisma prisma is an insanely good reprint this card hasn't been reprinted in some time prisma is a very very good card you got Mon moki moki miracle fusion as well if you're a hero player this is pretty good survival's end is also really good for dino and uh wild edge okay so i think that's it for the first box over here the first pre-constructed and so yeah again like i was saying if you guys are ever interested in getting into the tcg but not only the tcg specifically edison and other formats this set can be pretty good because it does reprint a lot of those cards i think there's a card in here that we haven't seen yet these are all the arcana force cards but uh there's a card in here that we haven't seen yet that's good for goat format as well and again a lot of the tcg cards can be used in the tcg format right so this is a really cool thing about these kind of sets they're very cheap they're very affordable you get access to be playing speed duel if you guys want to be playing speed duel and side note speed duel like side events at events they actually have some really good pricing there's a lot of really expensive pricing for speed duel dyna is one of these cards that can be played in the tcg and the current format but can also be played in edison format which is absolutely insane this is being used actually right now as we speak as an anti-meta card into a lot of decks in the format so you have stuff like dyna over here 
And you have so many other good cards that if you guys want to play TCG, you guys have access to that. If you guys want to be playing Edison, you guys have access to that. It doesn't have that many GOAT cards. Avarice is a pretty good card. But you have some stuff here like Mystical Space Typhoon. Sakuretsu Armor is another one. Foolish Burial is just a good staple in general to have. So if you're newer to the TCG and you're just trying to build up kind of some of your uh, staples and whatnot, this is not a bad set. And again, I'm always going to say I think these are all of our, uh, well, what are they called? Character cards? I forget what these are called. They're called uh, skill cards, skill cards. That's what they're called. All right, so that's what they are. And that's it for the pre-constructed stuff. So like I showed you guys in this pre-constructed decks, you guys can find that there's actually a lot of really good cards, but where you guys really want and why this set I think is actually really good are these promos. These promos, first of all, are absolutely insane. They have cards like, I'm actually gonna read them out to you guys because I have them open right now. So Miracle Fusion is a secret rare. Fossil Dig is a secret rare. You got Dandelion, you got Prisma, Dyna, Grand Mole, you got Baby Sarasaurus, Neos Alias. So all of these cards, like I said, they're good in Edison formats. They're good in TCG formats, past, future, whatever. These are all going to be relevant cards. Sakuretsu Armor as well for uh, go format players. And I'm going to open up this first one and then I'll open up the other two promo packs and just open up the promo packs. Uh, you guys don't need to see the cards over again, right? But just some of the reprints in here are absolutely insane. The cards that I personally want and I'm personally looking for are Prisma, Dyna, Neos was one of them. So that's nice. Neos Alias as well. Card Trooper, Baby Sarasaurus. So many good cards. In here. All right, so Neos as our first promo. We got Divine Wrath. This is the only thing that's not guaranteed, by the way. There's, I think, 20 total promos, and I think you only get five in here, I think. So if you want to get all 20, you're going to have to open up multiple of these, right? So Divine Wrath. We got Fossil Dig. This is a good secret rare here as well. We got Baby Sarasaurus. There we go. So technically, I believe this is the highest rarity of Baby Sarasaurus now in the in the game. So if you ever want to max out your Dino deck, this is the way to go, Baby Sarasaurus. And oh, that's it. It's only four. Okay, I thought it was five. It's only four. All right. So let me open up the other two, and then uh, let's see what we can pull. A few moments later. So I got the two promo packs out over here, but I actually forgot to show you guys. It does come with one of these paper play mats, but I think it's actually a two player play mat. Let me see if I can open this up. Oh, it is. Okay, okay, hold up. I'm gonna show you guys on the big screen here. So it's actually a two player play mat, and that's really cool because if you ever want to pick up Speed Duel with your friend, this is a, well, this is actually really nice. You get Neos on here, you get Arcana on here. That's pretty cool actually. So this is it full two-player play mat for anyone who wants to play speed duel i think it's actually really nice to have if you ever want to just pick some of these up play with your friends i'm gonna put this to the side though because i don't know how to fold it up right now all right so <laughs> let's get right into it over here though we got our first promo pack i actually put them out like this so i didn't see what's inside i don't want to see what the first card is i'm gonna open it up and find out with you guys at the exact same time because i don't want to know what it is i want to figure it out with you guys so for the first promo <laughs> We got Divine Wrath. Okay, maybe not the best one, but... Ooh, Card Trooper. There is a really, really good one. I'm excited about that one. That's a really good promo. We got another Baby Sarasaurus. Never going to complain. You need three of these. Most uh, Dino decks, actually, all oh, of Dino decks are going to be playing three of this. So I don't mind the second one. And we got Ultimate Tyranno. Okay, I'm very excited with this one as well. I, re I really like these promos. I actually collect these promos. If you guys don't know, you guys probably don't know because I don't talk about it a lot. I actually collect a lot of promo cards. So I think uh, it's really nice to be able to even open this up. And even if I get cards that I don't necessarily need to play, I can use them for uh, my promo collection. But speaking of... I don't want to double up on these cards, right? Because I don't need two for the collection. But it's okay. Ultimate Tyrant over here. Let's see if we can get a place out of Baby Sarasaurus. That would be a good, good pull for us. We got Divine Wrath. Okay. So Divine Wrath loves us. That's a place out of Divine Wrath. Let's see if we can get a Baby and a Fossil Dino. Let's do it. Ooh, Arcana Force EX. Okay. You know what? This is still not a bad card. And the last card of today's opening. Three, two, one. Arcana Force the World. You know what? I like the Arcana cards. It's uh, very on theme with the set. And I'm actually still like, I still love this artwork so much. Like, I, I just really like this artwork. But that's pretty much it. I don't think we did too bad on the promos. I'll be honest with you. Maybe they could have been the better ones. You know, Dyna specifically, Prisma are two that I wanted. But you know what? For such a cheap set, you guys can pick this up, pick up the promos. And I actually don't think the promos are going to be worth too much anyway. So uh, that's going to be pretty good as well. If you guys want to max out your decks, you guys can just pick up them up as singles as well. But thank you guys all for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We don't do too much speed duel here on the channel, but I really wanted to open it up for you guys because I think it's one of those sets where it actually can be really good if you're picking this up even as a TCG player, right? If you're using it for Edison, there's a lot of good Edison cards in here. If you're using it for modern format, there's a lot of really good modern format cards in here as well. And if you guys just want to play speed duel, I I think this is a really cool set for that format, I guess you say, right? So if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more Yu-Gi-Oh! content just like this one. Thank you guys all for watching. I appreciate every single one of you guys. We upload seven days a week here on the channel, five shorts a week and two long videos. You guys might even get more than that, but seven at a minimum. So you guys make sure to subscribe to stay tuned into all of that. Thank you all for watching. And with that, Spanko signing out. Peace.